Good afternoon, everyone. My name is John Wilkinson, and um, I'm here to talk to you a little bit about positive mental attitude and goal setting, the differences between success and failure. I work uh, from Morrison Group. Uh, Morrison Group obviously um, was founded to provide customized training and development to organizations of all types with a focus on life skills, motivational skills, and vocational skills, and the founding partners, Kevin L. Morrison. Positive mental attitude and goal setting. Along with other healthcare professionals, we help facilitate 22 classes annually. Um, such classes as a PCT, mental health informational specialist, registered nurse, CNA, medical billing. I'm sure some of you are familiar with these. Um, they're just a few positions offered to these clients at the workplace in Bridgeport, Connecticut. Um, we have revised our curriculum of soft skills to address the healthcare audience, particularly in adding goal setting as a focus. Our clients and the community need teachers, leaders, specialists that care and can identify with their current state or situation. Professionals that focus on the improvement and the future success. When they don't see it, we make it our business to see it because everyone has potential. Our curriculum and method of training help clients to establish or reestablish a foundation of self-worth. Individuals recognize their value and self-worth with the introduction of positive mental attitude. From unemployment, underemployment, to being laid off or inadequate training, clients have felt and experienced the worst of our socioeconomic pressures. People face negatives every day and find very little to smile about. The discussion of these aspects in a shared setting creates a bond and demonstrates you're not alone. A positive mental attitude is a choice. You can choose to stay where you are or you can choose to do something about it. If you want different results, you have to do something different. Author Napoleon Hill said, keep your mind on the things you want and off the things you don't want. A positive mental attitude says we have the power to redirect our thinking. We help clients to find the fire or motivation within by recognizing their strengths through goal setting. We all have strengths. We need to set goals. We need to write goals down. We need to develop strategies to accomplish these goals. Studies have shown that 40% of getting a job is attitude. Clients are taught to cultivate the very best every day. Kind of missed something there, but that's okay. <laughs> Positive mental attitude and goal setting together helps the clients to write it down, focus on goals, set goals, reminders, and benchmark dates for success. Positive mental attitude training is the process by which you break the habit of responding negatively to a situation and develop a new habit of a positive reaction. The point. Developing, maintaining, and improving your attitude requires training, practice, hourly, daily, and weekly effort. Learn it, practice it, master it, excel in it. In healthcare setting or position, these key tools are priceless. Thank you.